Peter Dutton has used his ministerial powers to ensure an Italian au pair planning to work for a former Queensland police colleague could stay in the country, the ABC understands. The revelation comes days after it emerged the Home Affairs Minister freed a French au pair from detention after AFL boss Gillan McLaughlin got involved in that case. From Parliament House, here's political reporter Caitlin Gribben. Italian woman Michaela Marchiso was upbeat about her trip down under. In June 2015, she told her Facebook friends she'd finally arrived and was enjoying local delicacies. But the day before, she was in custody at the Brisbane airport. Border Force officials believed Michaela Marchiso was planning to work in Australia as an au pair in breach of her tourist visa. But then Immigration Minister Peter Dutton intervened. I think it stinks. I think the Australian public would say it reeks of hypocrisy. This phrase au pair, it sounds exotic and so I think the media are, are fixated on it but I really don't think there's anything to see here. The ABC understands Ms Marquiso was planning to work for a former Queensland police colleague of Mr Dutton's. It's unclear whether the family lobbied him directly or whether the minister was aware of the family's connections to the au pair. And the ABC is not suggesting Ms Marquiso breached her visa conditions while in Australia. Peter Dutton overruled advice from his department and gave the Italian au pair a three-month tourist visa. We get a situation where uh, the Minister is advised against granting uh, visas. Uh, there's high risk according to the border force in the email trail we've seen. Well, I make a decision that I believe is in uh, the best interests of our country. I do it every day with uh, visas and the whole idea of ministerial intervention powers is that you can find a situation where it's been brought to your attention, there's an anomaly, and you can fix it. If they have a good case for being unlikely to abscond, then, you know, he lets them go free, and I think that's the right thing to do. The revelation comes just days after it emerged the Home Affairs Minister freed a French au pair from detention after AFL boss Gillan McLaughlin got involved in the case. Today he's denied he received special treatment. I think it's been said that there's hundreds of representations uh, put to the office and it's up to the, to the office to make those decisions. All I did was facilitate an email getting to the office. This is troubling instance of a, a pattern that's starting to emerge. Peter Dutton says his opposite number would have the same power if Labor wins government. Caitlin Gribben, ABC News, Canberra.